What you guys today we're going to be taking a look at how to mirror your Android screen to a PC without any root. Now we're going to be using the screen stream over HTTP which is a useful little uh, piece of software which you can install on your Android phone. Now once you get this installed you'll be able to open up your browser on your computer and you'll be able to share your screen on your Android phone over to your PC without any root uh, or anything like that, any sort of software. It's very simple and easy to do. So let me go ahead and get this set up and I'll show you how it works. It's very useful for quick display on your PC screen from your phone. So what we're gonna do is head over to my phone and show you how to install the app. So go to the Play Store here. This is the Google Play Store. You can do a search for that particular piece of software and it's called uh, Screen Stream on HTTP you should see it here I'm going to click on this and there we can now install this piece of software so hit the install once you've hit install it's a little small uh, installation as you can see here we can click on the open and this will be the actual application itself so when I uh, click on play here you should see a little HTTP colon forward slash forward slash with an IP address that's the IP address it's going to be displayed on your computer so I'm going to push play and then head over to my computer so now as you can see here this is the IP address I just typed in my browser on my computer and you can see here we are now getting the display from the phone very quickly over HTTP very simple and easy to do now this piece of software does have its good points and its bad points and I'll go over those in this video. First off, the bad point is there will be no audio. It doesn't uh, capture the audio, but it does have plenty of uh, options available in here, like dark theme. You can see here device notification settings, minimize on stream and start, you know, stop stream on sleep, start stream on boot. You've got a bunch of other stuff like auto start, stop streaming, uh, notify for slow connections, enable web uh, page buttons, and also web page background color got a bunch of other things like virtual reality mode, crop image, resize image, uh, rotate image clockwise and also JPEG compression quality which is set at 80 but you can make this higher if you wish but they're the options inside there we've got also some security you can enable a pin which means you would have to uh, put the pin code in to display this onto your uh, actual screen here on your computer so if you want to enable that, you can put the checkbox in there and it'll open up a load of other features. Use Wi-Fi only, enable IPv6 support and also server port. You can choose your own server port and enable application logs if you wish. Here is some information about the application itself. So if you're in a quick jam and you want to quickly display your uh, phone screen on your actual desktop here, you can do it very quickly. Once you start the app, you just need to go to your browser and type in the IP address it gives you. And uh, basically, you should be able to see uh, the display start. Now, you can see this is my full display here, which is from my phone. And I'll show you some other things that you can do as well. So you can share this as well across to other people if you want to. So you just send, hit the share button and click on the person you want to share it to. So that's also a nice little feature there. And you've got a bunch of other things you can do, like take a snapshot and uh, things like that. Now, it will display a uh, normal phone display, i.e. Uh, games and other things like that. Sometimes they can be a little bit jerky, uh, but it's not really sort of high, high level uh, screen sharing. And uh, you will see a little slight delay, and, but it's very useful for quick things. You can see it's quite responsive. Uh, when you're just doing certain tasks but when you're trying to do games and stuff like that it might be a little bit jerky for those types of things so i'll give you a quick demo here so you can see so here we have a little basic game here and if i just toss the paper here you can see there's a little slight delay here but nothing too crazy but if you want to quickly display that on your screen you can do and again you can also turn it the other way around so if you want to rotate your phone it will also automatically rotate on the browser as well which is a nice added touch so let me just quickly show you that I'm going to go to YouTube here and you'll be able to see the scrolling works really nice nice and smooth remember we haven't got any software installed on the PC or anything like that and you can rotate it as well this way 
then you can do a bunch of other stuff here but let me just show you here what it looks like there we go now, of course you can stream content on here as well if you wish it's very easy to do you can stream content that's quite smooth but you won't have any audio but you will have the audio coming from the phone and that's going to be pretty much it that's basically how you can quickly mirror your Android screen uh, to your PC without root using HTTP. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you again real soon for another video. Bye for now. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.